Hey guys, welcome back to the channel. Today Microsoft released the Windows 11 Insider Preview Build 25211 to the dev channel. Starting with this build, we have some new settings for the widgets. In this update, Microsoft separated the widget picker and widget settings to make it easier for us to find and interact with each view. Next to that, Windows Insiders who are also Office Insiders can try out the new Outlook for Windows. Office Insiders running beta channel or current channel preview will see a try the new Outlook toggle located in the upper right corner of your classic Outlook for Windows. Next to that, Snipping Tool will now automatically save the screenshots. Microsoft is rolling out an update for Snipping Tool to Windows Insiders, in the Dev Channel. With this update, Snipping Tool supports automatically saving the screenshots to the Pictures folder. If you don't have this feature, try updating your Microsoft library. So, that was the only new feature, introduced to this build. However, the experience isn't available to all insiders. Talking about the changes and improvements, for the taskbar, Microsoft has added Task Manager to the context menu when right-clicking on the taskbar. For the system tray, this build includes preliminary support to rearrange system tray icons for insiders who have the system tray updates that began rolling out with build 25197. As a reminder, these system tray updates are still rolling out and are not available to all insiders just yet. For File Explorer, fixed an issue where the top part of File Explorer, with a search and address box, couldn't be interacted with when File Explorer was in full screen mode. For the settings, for the time being, you will no longer be able to uninstall apps with interdependencies, for example, Steam and gaming apps running on Steam, or repair Win32 apps under Settings, Apps, Installed Apps. You will still be able to modify and uninstall Win32 apps without interdependencies. So, that was all about the changes and improvements, for this build. Talking about the fixes. General fix. Microsoft is beginning to roll out a server-side fix for the issue causing a date, time, and time zone settings or incorrect message to be improperly displayed, which was also preventing the installation of the latest Insider Preview builds from proceeding. For the start, when you have start set to show more pinned items, the animation for opening folders lower on the page will now appear from the right place. For the task manager, Tweak the graphs in the performance page to use a bit more transparency so it's easier to see the grid lines underneath. So, that was all from Microsoft for this build. If you want to know more, follow the link to the official Microsoft blog, from the description. Hope it was useful. Consider like for the video, subscribe to the channel, and if you have any questions, just comment down below. Thanks for watching, and have a great day ahead.